The House of Representatives has advocated for the payment of living wages to Nigerian workers at the rate that would be commensurate with current economic realities across the world. In its resolution following a motion sponsored by the minority leader of the House, Kingsley China, and 37 other members, the House resolved to transit its resolution to the Senate for concurrence. The federal government recently set up a tripartite committee made up of persons drawn from the executive, organized labor, state government, and the organized private sector to negotiate with the minimum wage. Moving the motion on behalf of the sponsors, Deputy Minority Leader of the House, Ali Usani Madaki, said the rising rate of inflation in the country has made it difficult for average Nigerians to afford basic needs such as food, water, housing, education, healthcare, transportation, and clothing. He explained that the rising inflationary rate in the country has also hurt the cost of living, with the cost of food, accommodation, education, and transportation skyrocketing. The federal government offered palliatives to cushion its effect. However, the ameliorative effect of these measures has been overtaken by the continued rise in the cost of goods and services. Further aware that the minimum wage in Nigeria was increased by the president recently, but the purchasing power is low owing to the continued rise in the cost of living in the country and the fall of the Naira. Again, aware that trade economics in 2018 reported the living wage of an individual Nigerian as a Nigerian family to be 43,000 Naira 200 per month and 137,600 Naira per month, respectively. This is a pre-subsidy removal report. Further note that presently, no laborer can live in Nigeria with a wage of less than 100,000 Naira. Concern that according to the World Bank report, low purchasing power in the country occasioned by high inflationary rate has led to an increase in poverty across the country. The House directed its relevant committees of labor and employment, finance and national planning to work out modalities for the payment of living wages to Nigerian workers at rates that match economic realities. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.